one shot together. You gotta put two, three shots together to the body, not one at a time. Bam, 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 bam. You gotta keep the head moving. Now we're gonna pressure. see the first good combination by Butte. First good combination. Three punch combination. And here's a straight left. Square in the face. Butte landed 62% of his power punches in that round. 16 of 26 as we get set for the bell to begin. Round number four here in Quebec. Let's check in with our unofficial <laughs> ringside score, Harold. Let okay, it. Bob. Three rounds to nothing. 30 to 27. Lucian Boutte. Bob, I gotta tell you, this guy is about as slick as anyone I've ever seen. I mean, you know, I've never seen this outfit with a right up jab like he throws. I mean, he's real good legs, great movement, nice ring generalship, and he keeps hitting him with that right up jab. And then when, when Loretto and Freddy's looking for the jab, he comes across with that straight left hand. In round three, he landed more clean power shots that he did in rounds one and two. Three to nothing, Boutte. Hey, one thing here to start round number four, guys. Uh, Andrade landed a couple of good uppercuts that seemed to get the attention of Boutte in a hurry. Yeah, Boutte's winning every round, of course, but I feel like Andrade's doing better than he was in the first fight. Well, he's actually I thought round up. number two was in the balance. Of number two. He's picking up the pace, though. But a good start to round four, at least. The old adage in boxing is if one fighter knocks out another fighter, he'll do it again in the rematch only quicker. The question is, was that a knockout in the first fight in Boutet's mind, I suppose? I guess the thing that it, you see here, Lennox, possibly, in Max, is that Boutet has landed some very clean punches to Andrade. And he just, you know, as he does, he stands there and he keeps coming back. But it seems as if in this round, some of these power shots that Andrade's landing are causing Boutet a moment of pause. Well, and then here's the... Not that this round is difficult to score right now, but the subjective nature of scoring. Boutet lands really hard against the Andrade with a rock-solid chin. Andrade does not land as hard. Oh! oh left hand drops Andrade! Oh! He didn't see that one coming. It's only the second time Andrade's ever been off his feet. And it was a quick punch, too. Straight on the chin. Remember, dropped him in round 10 of their first fight. Good left hand inside. Andrade says it's not a problem when he takes big shots, when he sees them. I don't think he saw that left. Well, what happens is when you keep tapping on the rock, any rock, eventually it will break. Well, as I was saying, <laughs> that Andrade has the rock solid chin. Boutte just flattened him with an with a punch he didn't see coming, as you mentioned. Oh, and yeah. that is down again. I think he's hurt badly. I mean, was that a body punch or a head punch? He seems hurt. I think it was a body shot. Wow. And guys, just like Daniel Zaragoza, who was never stopped in his career until he fought Eric Morales. When he was finally stopped, it was with a body shot. Lucian Boutte wanted to erase the doubts of their first fight, and he did it emphatically tonight. Well, like I said, in an outstanding fashion. And incidentally, I don't think this is a case of overestimating Andrade's ability to take a punch. That's well documented in his career so far. That's Boutte just being sensational. Well, most guys that can take head punches all day usually are soft in the body, as in the case this time. Sixteen thousand five hundred fans came to see Lucian Boutte erase any doubts, and he did. You know, a lot of people are shocked because they thought this fight was going to go the distance. And I'm, I'm sure, I'm sure. We really need.
need to see the replay on this and uh, we're going to take a look at the first one which is a short left inside that Andrade never saw. Knockdown number one. As good as it gets Lennox. And there wasn't there wasn't too much power behind that It was just more of a quick jarring shot. Take a look at it again. Step right into it. Good short punch Lennox. But Andrade seemed okay after that. Even gave a little smile while he was down. And a wink. And then when Boutte couldn't finish him to the head. These are all the first knockdown. Three different angles. The super slow mo. And that's just a good, clean, short punch that Andrade didn't see coming. Now here's the end. Boom. Right there. Left oh. hand right to the stomach and ribs. Knocked the air right out of him. He couldn't recover at all. And it must have been a perfect shot because you know when you get hit in the body and it's still early rounds, you know you can re you can really recover from that. But in this situation, he wasn't able to recover, and I think he caught him just perfectly. There could be even a rib problem.